on these over here. That was scary. Uh, he was over here when he spawned. He was here. Well, I've never had a problem with them before, so. Um, that kind of sucks. Oh, well. I'm okay. I just need some food. Yeah. Um, the, let me just go kill the rest of these. Yeah. Oh, I could have got this beef jerky, too. I'm unlocking hats. There's a mod that you unlock hats for doing things. Sometimes mobs spawn with like wearing hats. Yeah. So you can unlock them and then wear them by pressing, I think it's H on the keyboard. Yeah, it's how you edit what hat you're wearing. So I've unlocked like three hats already just killing these mobs here. So if that means anything to anybody. Wait. How's it going, Chase? <laughs> I almost have ten That's levels. Fun. Ten levels is where I can unlock my first extra slot. All right. So back to crafting my Tinker's Construct pieces. I made blank patterns. I made a stencil table part crafter. Let me go ahead and make that. And then let me make, I think it's a chest and a blank pattern. Yep. All right. Did I build everything? I think I built all of my, oh, a tool station. I haven't built that yet. Mitch is online. <laughs> he doesn't need to know we're on right now. Because I don't have, feel like having to have him join right now. Yeah, we're almost done for... Yeah, for the night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I want to... No, we're good. Wow, we got a ton of apples, too. Yeah, we do. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is you need to go to a stencil table. Then you'll store the stencils in a pattern chest. And then you'll create. Then you'll use the tool station. No, this is last. You'll use the part builder, and then you'll use the tool station. Pick up his level. Mm -hmm. All right. Just don't answer him. <laughs> all righty, all righty, all righty. There we go. Um, I have officially... We need to now make a tool from bone or flint. So we'll go ahead and make a bone so, tool right here. What do we got to do? Um... Alright, so let me go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah. Ah, uh, Chase. Mm-hmm. Want to make the second level? Uh, sure. Because that's the achievement next.
because we're going to have to start storage soon because it's starting there to get sloppy. Oh, hey, we have lava. Do we? Mm -hmm. Nice. But do we have a bucket? Oh, we do. Well, I'm going to go kill some of these mobs. Yeah, go get them. Guess what? What? We got lava. Oh, we do? Is it? Could it finish them all? Mm hmm. Finish all? Oh, it did. Okay, well, we'll deal with that in a bit because we only have the clay bucket and we can only use that once. Right. So we have to already have the generator put up and all I need to do is place the block. But, yeah, go ahead and shift all that. Alright, the Tinker's Construct is all set up and ready to be used. So we'll use some bone to make some tools here. We got some more grass seeds. Awesome. And 25... Uh, stone. 26 all together. Oh, so, wow. Go put some of those oak saplings back in the buckets. Oh, yeah, we got four out, so... I got a potato. You got a potato? Mm -hmm. Ooh, we should grow that too with one of these pieces of dirt that you get from this, Necker. And a miniature red heart. Hmm. I haven't used those yet, but apparently you can use them to expand how many hearts you have. Hmm. So we'll save those. I got some bone. So, like, for instance, if we get that item, we don't know what to do with it. If you just search miniature red heart. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have 13 pieces of the cobble, so we need to put a generator on mm -hmm. that. Yes, yeah, so if you click, if you right click on the item in there, you can see what recipes it's used in, and it's used to make a red heart canister, which is which is a permanent health increase. But in order to use that, we need a jeweled apple, which is diamonds around an apple. So we can't do that yet. Um, let's go ahead and make. I'm going to make a tool here, um, and you guys could make tools as well. I'll show you. Um, let's make a hatchet. That's what we can use probably right now. That'll probably be the best use if we can make um, a stone. A, I mean a. Um, no, you have the template, right? Yeah. So if you come it. here and you click on this far right one, these are all the different tools you could make. Okay. So hatchet is probably what we're gonna make. Um, and in order to make it, you need an axe head and a handle. So this right. far left one here. Uh -huh. What this does, this is a pattern maker. So I made some blank patterns, and if I put a blank pattern in here, you can choose from these stencils. So, for instance, I see there's a hatchet head, axe head pattern, and uh -huh. then I'll make a handle, which I think is oh. the first one. Okay, yeah, so pattern. how do I make a blank pattern again? No, what is it? Yeah, use that book, and you'll see that it is a... It's like two sticks and two things okay so we can't once you make a pattern you can hold shift on the pattern and you can see um what it can be like what materials you can use now we cannot make a hatchet with bone you can make a flint or a stone hatchet but i don't want to wait oh no we can make bone never mind i'm lied i lied um this pattern chest here in the middle this is where you'll store them because once you make a stencil for something no need to make more you can just store them in the chest but I'm going to go here into this next one, which is the part builder. As soon as my internet works. Hmm. There we go. So then I'll put a bone in there, and we get a bone axe head. And then I'll put a tool rod pattern in there, and I get a bone tool. So if any of you want to make your own hatchet, there's the parts for it. You go down here in the end, you put the two parts together. You can also name it if you wanted to. So 
So I'll name this bone. I'll name this hatchet. Hatcher. Sure, that works. Hatcher. So I've now made a bone hatchet. Now the way this works is it works nicely. Now when it, but so basically this tool exists forever now, right? So when I if I break it, then I go to repair it. I don't have to recraft a whole new bone thing, right? I can just repair it. And in addition, the more I use it, the more skill levels I get. So sometimes you'll create bonuses. Basically, they're like enchantments, but they're like weak enchantments. Mm -hmm. So as you use it a lot, you'll get gems that'll be added onto it, and it'll make it better. Uh, so, dance. so I think it'd be in anybody's best interest to make a bone hatchet. So let me put these bones in this chest so that you guys can use bones if you want to. I'm also going to go plant this potato. Okay, I need... I can't find... Is it a rod that I need to make? Um, I already made the patterns for it. So if you oh. go in the pattern chest, you can just use those. So that if you just click on the part oh. builder, it'll just access the chest itself, and you can just pull them from there. Okay. All right, I've planted the potato, by the way. All right, Chase is using that, so I'm going to wait. So there's a whole bunch of different cool tools you can make. Some of them have multi-use. I think the one you can use to, like, hoe land, cut trees, and shovel dirt, like, all together or something. Mm. Um, Mike, we need to make a storage room. Yes, we'll work on that here. We yeah. Get the, um, we can get the, uh, what's it called, working. The uh, cobblestone generator. Yes. I think we have the resources to safely make that now. I'm also really close. I want to get 10 levels so I can unlock my first inventory slot. Because that's an achievement as well. But now this hatchet works so fast to cut down trees. And it only costs a little bit of bone to repair. Which is so nice. So, did you figure it out, Necker? I'm getting there. I'm trying to figure out how to make the HUD. Uh, oh, I need. Do I need a piece of bone for yes, you need a piece of the bone. So if you hold your mouse over the, like the actual pattern. Yeah, the, the part stencil, over, and yeah. then you hold shift. It'll show you what materials you can use. Okay. To make that. So some uh, of them you can't use bone, some of them you can use flint. Flint is what I ended up making most of my tools out of in my single player. Yeah. Okay. Do we have any bone? Yes, there's bone in here. Yeah, because I got the bone tool rod. That's easy. Yeah, we need to make a storage room shortly because this is filling up. Um, is there anything we need to do with dirt? Do you want to plant another pair? Of, like, we have another seed. Do we want to plant that one as well? Should I plant the pumpkins, uh, too, with these four, or should I sift them? We have 13 stones. I think plant. we'll need more than that for the... What do you guys think? Should I, sh should I sift, or should I use to plant crops? I'm going to sift, because we're going to make a cobblestone generator. We can always use more. Yay! I got it. It's a bit confusing, but... Yeah. I'll definitely be asking questions. Oh, I got sugarcane seeds. Oh, nice. Okay, so next piece of dirt, we're definitely planting sugarcane. Yeah. Actually, no. No. Let's break no. a piece of cobblestone into sand, because it grows faster on sand. Yeah, sand Let's is faster. That. So is this bone now, uh, is it faster than? It's faster than wood for sure, yes. Okay.
Now, uh, we should, should we make the, uh, we should make the storage room big enough. And right, now we should on, add. Let's do the generator first. Okay, yeah. Let's do the generator uh, first. Where do you want to do it? Uh, let's do it over here. Because from the generator, we're going to oh, want to pipe giant barrels full of cobblestone with transfer nodes. Okay. And then we're going to use that to create our automatic system of sifting and hammering and stuff like that. Okay. Okay, so when we do this here. Let's see. So we'll put the lava on this side. The lava will flow and it'll drop. The lava needs to drop down one before the, no, the water has to drop down one, right? Mm-hmm. Um, I probably should have built this one more up. Hang on. I want to make the best use of our cobblestone. Yeah. Somebody want to get a bucket of water? Use that clay bucket and fill it with water and bring it over. I got it. The fire clay one, right? We can, we can use that for, for water and lava. Uh, where we use it for water. Once you use it for lava, it will disappear. Okay. the water actually I probably have to place cobble here sorry I got you oh still not good no here there here can you place that right here the water that yeah, where are you saying Perfect. Okay, let me go okay so now lava will go right here. The question is, is things going to catch on fire? How far does fire spread? What do you think, Chase? Chase is busy crafting weapons. Yeah, <laughs> so we're having fun. Mm -hmm. This will work as a generator, but do you think the lava will spread? I don't know. All right, well, we'll, we'll here. Get, actually, let me go see if we've got any clay, because I might be able to craft another bucket as a backup. Yeah. Just in case, so we have water. Um, we don't have the clay, but I can make a piece of clay, which we should we should probably have a backup to do this, shouldn't we? Because uh -huh. we have to flood uh -huh. everything to put it. Have a, do you want to have a backup? to grab the lava source in case something goes wrong. I won't grab the water. I'll turn it to obsidian before I waste a bucket. <laughs> Can you bring that bucket over and fill one of these barrels up with lava or with water? Yep. Thank you. Oh, my bad. No worries. Okay, I'm going to grab the lava. Go for it. Okay. And then go place it. Give me one minute before you place it so I can at least have this ready with water just in case. Yeah.
By the way, beef jerky heals too. Just FYI. Good. All right, Good go ahead and place it. All right, successful cobblestone generator. Let's leave it like that and see if the lava catches anything on fire. Okay, I'm going to get food. Go for it. Check off the achievement. Yep, all right, so we have officially finished the wood age, haven't we? Mm-hmm. It's a pretty good milestone point. That is, because you know what that means. It means we no longer need... Well, we can basically use all of the dirt for farming and for making an animal farm. Sweet. So, the next thing is going to be making a storage room, which will be a second layer to the island. Okay. And then, we'll, as we build that, we'll chop down trees. We'll make an animal spawning area. Because we have the grass seeds, we'll get the dirt, and we'll be good. Yep. We need to make a st we need to make a stone barrel and a tinker's construct smeltery. That's down the road a little bit. Yeah. yeah. But well, I a don't... stone barrel. We could work on making a stone barrel. I think we could make that right now. Yeah, I think we could. All right. Um. Well, we so, can, Chase, since you've cut a bunch of trees down, if you want to make a stone barrel, I can, uh, I'll work on some trees while we wait to see if that stuff burns down. Because otherwise we can start, uh, cutting things down. Because you could make a, you could make a, I don't think you can make bone pickaxes. I think you can make flint, but not bone. So we're not quite ready for that. We might just have to use wood pickaxes. Oh yeah, it is nice and fast. sword yeah i might make a repairable one out of bone can you make a chase have you made a bone sword by any chance not yet can you make a bone sword or is it only flint i don't know uh you got the bucket still mike yes i do just in case but i'm gonna okay. go take care of there's a ton of mobs over here well, there's a witch over here oh and baking donut is here nice <laughs> Wow, we're already on day eight. Yes, already more than a weekend. Bacon donut, I'm sorry I've killed you. I think they're gonna like this, your viewers. Yeah, no, this is fun. I haven't had a, I needed a multiplayer thing on here. Ooh, I got a witch's hat. Nice. It doesn't do anything, but I don't, I don't know what it's used for, but I know you can wear it and it's supposed to do something. No, you need. You should make stone obsidian nether rock. No. No what? bone sword. No bone. Can you make flint or stone? You should make stone. Okay. Then you make. You want to make? Because we have the cobblestone generator. Remember, we have unlimited stone now. Stone isn't some rare commodity that we have to sift a bunch of stuff for. We can get it. Oh, here comes the rain again. Hey, oh, guys, we got ten levels. We need a pickaxe then. Okay. Hey, Mike. Here. I, I put a creeper head on. Oh, nice. That actually doesn't look any different. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? There's no creeper head. Right? Looks the creeper exact head. same. <laughs> Here, I'll wear a witch's hat. Ah, <laughs> oh, nice.